you're here with uh, Johnny Alduino and me on our uh, excursion down to the southwest and some of the new areas for the Something Feels Wrong YouTube channel. Uh, Alduino, I'm glad you're with us. This is something we wanted to do for a long time together. Yes, I'm very grateful and very happy because we have been planning this for months, I mean for a year. Yeah, it takes time sometimes when you're really busy, but uh, Johnny, tell us a little bit where we're going here because um, we've been working on this for almost a year now in this area and we're getting real close to releasing it. Yeah. So uh, we'll go back and forth in Spanish and English sure. and Alduino, mix in all you can and let's just have a bunch of fun here and make a good three day trip of this, okay? So yeah. you tell them where we are and I'll concentrate on the driving for a bit. Well guys, we're uh, actually on our way to a new place. Well, I was here actually last year, but. Uh, place called Rancho Arriba and um, it's a brand uh, new road I was here last September with my girlfriend Justine and it's a beautiful place uh, very quaint has a big uh, production it's renowned for being the number one place for a greenhouse production in the uh, Dominican Republic such as peppers tomatoes um, it's very big in coffee production very big in chinola and all the different other types of fruit and vegetables. Um, it's also, um, uh, there's a lot of investment here with people buying in there and investing in like small thinkers and land to do the, uh, the produce. So I'm really happy and excited to be back here again. And it's been for me pretty much almost a year as well. So there were a lot of changes. The road, as you can see, is pretty much only about just over a year old. Uh, when I was here, I saw some construction going up, so I'm excited to see the changes and see what's been going on in this town, Rancho Arriba. Hey, mira, explicar en español con la especial de fruta y lulu. Okay, tenemos aquí, somos aquí en un lugar que se llama Rancho Arriba, y aquí en este lugar hay una fruta muy especial, se llama lulu. Y yo no sé cuál es el, el nombre en inglés, seguro hay otro nombre en español también, pero y pronto nosotros tenemos ese nombre en inglés. Pues bien, ese fruto lulú es muy popular ahora, eh, especialmente en el sur, y no bien conocido allá en el norte todavía. Es una fruta, parece como una pera eh, eh, en sabor. Eh, es muy bueno en Roma, como mi asocio sabe pero es una fruta muy popular aquí en este lugar. Se llama Lulu. Tú sé, Alduino, tú sé la, la fruta de Lulu es el nuevo para ti. Esa fruta es desconocida hasta ahora para mí, hasta que no lleguemos luego a la plantación o yo pueda verla y pueda identificar, porque como dijo Johnny antes, la fruta a veces tienen distintos nombres uh -huh. y no sé si ese sea el nombre tradicional o sea el nombre científico de la fruta de la cual estamos hablando. Okay guys, what Alduino and Johnny are talking about, we all, you know, we both, uh, all three of us speak both languages, but basically for the English crowd, it's a new fruit called Lulu. There is not really an English name for it. Um, they're exporting tons of this stuff to Europe, right bud? Europe, Europe, right? Europe, Europe and uh, the Caribbean islands and as well. And the Caribbean islands. Mm -hmm. And uh, it's also new for my buddy Alduino. Uh, it's, it's a new blend here and it's kind of like a cross between a pear and a, uh, an a orange. Prune. And, a prune. A prune and a pear. It's yeah. sweet. It's got that. It's a cross between both of them. And um, I'm really glad old Alduino's with us because God darn it, we all work together and we're going to have a good time at night. We're going to be drinking rum, smoking cigars, and doing that kind of thing. But, you know, just to keep you guys in the front seat with us, we just, I mean, I know how these guys feel, and I know how I feel. We can't thank you enough for making this YouTube channel as popular as it is, eh, guys? Yeah, we yeah. appreciate everyone, you know, subscribing. We appreciate all the comments. And we're all doing our best to keep you updated on the new events that are going on with Something Feels Wrong. Yeah, the construction's all around Cabrera, but so much more than just our region of Cabrera. Exactly. For me, this was special to get Alduino out here, because Alduino is obviously, he's, you know, born and raised here, pardon the joke. But the thing is, I, we're getting Alduino into some areas that he hasn't seen, probably, I'm sure. 
I'm going to take him uh, do a little bit of off-road and uh, probably tomorrow, which is going to be really neat for him. Uh, we're going to probably get close to 8,000 feet. Okay, 8,000 above sea level. 8,000 feet above sea level. It's going to be cold. You might see smoke from your breath. So anyway, we want you guys to come along. This is going to be the first video of a bunch of them. So sit back. Tighten up your seat belts, have a good time, enjoy some music, and ride along with us. We'll catch you guys later. So this is Barry and Adueno and Johnny. We'll talk to you soon. Bye. Bye guys. Bye guys.